Hello folks, Cameron here for another episode of Cameron's Pantry. Um, you probably noticed these. I finally got some glasses so I can see. I'm nearsighted so I have to see very far. And when, when it's far it's blurry. I came across these at the Salvation Army store. They were $1.99. I thought, oh, reading glasses. I'll just see if they fit well so I can use them for a roll in any kind of film or video project. And lo and behold, they were prescription. And I could see far away. This is so close to my prescription that I was really floored by, by the find. But since this is an episode of Cameron's Pantry, I'm still going on the spicy challenge kick and I'm glad that I can finally see far away because I need these if I'm going to travel around the country with my fiance soon to be wife for her show RV Pinan USA and we're still looking for donations and sponsors for that and still looking for an RV still looking after the replacement one got taken. So, let's go with uh, what I'm going to show you right now. The Patry Challenge had the one chip challenge. Well, this one is only kind of hot. They have a gauge which goes from not hot, kind of hot, hot, super hot, freaking hot. And when I tried the ghost pepper, it wasn't all that freaking hot. I mean, the haunted ghost pepper was okay, but it wasn't super spicy. However, the uh, green chili lemon, 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 I, I can never pronounce that correctly. So sorry if my Spanish is horrible. But um, that one only tasted like Doritos, spicy Doritos chips to me. And that was supposed to be super hot. Well, this one is on the second. Okay, here, I'll, let me show you. This is what we're gonna try today. And on the back, you can see the gauge. Well, they do have a smooth hit of sour cream in it, tangy tomatillo, tart lime juice, one serving size per container, which is non-GMO project verified, certified gluten-free, no artificial ingredients, no artificial flavors, no preservatives. There's only 280 calories per serving. As I said, this is the one serving. With only 14 grams of total fat, two grams saturated fat, no cholesterol. There's 380 milligrams of sodium in it, along with 36 grams of total carbohydrates, which includes two grams of dietary fiber, one gram sugar and of course there's four grams protein in it however there is um, calcium iron and potassium in it low amounts but still healthy and that's kind of stretching it especially where tortilla chips are concerned but, according to Pacqui, mild is not in their vocabulary. So they always go for hot stuff. And this is from Texas. Well, distributed in te Texas. Well, anyway, let's, I do have, just in case, get into this thing. Kinda hot, huh? Ooh. Good scent to it. 
Yeah, it does smell kind of spicy. You can smell the peppers, the uh, salsa verde in it as well. This is the chips. Looks rather harmless. Hmm. Okay, this is akin to a Cool Ranch Dorito chip. It is not kind of hot. Has a good crunch to it though. But if I was recommending it, I would. This would pair well with sandwiches. Tuna sandwiches would be great with it. Cold cuts, salami. It's not bad. But it's not hot. Yes, that'll be it for now. I'm Cameron Farmer for Cameron's Pantry. Until next time. Bye bye.